This project aims to teach them how to prototype using Europeana API to co-develop solutions to social challenges and to improve educational practices. So what are APIs? That's a big question, um, but to put it as simply uh, as I can, an API stands for Application Programming Interface, and it's basically a way to easily, reliably, and um, in an interoperable way connect to databases that are either your own database or other people's database. So it is a way to interact with other people's data online in a way that works in a machine-readable way. You can use APIs in a classroom in a lot of ways. Uh, to me, the most important thing when it comes to teaching students about APIs is to show them how data flows between different programs and applications and pieces of software that they're very used to. So teaching uh, students about APIs can really increase their media literacy and really increase the um, critical view that they have towards the um, overall software they use every day. The main benefit of creating your own API or having an API is that you um, provide other people with a really easy way to access your data um, in a way that is interoperable. So if you are using APIs, the benefit of that is that um, you can access someone else's database in a way that you know exactly what to expect and you don't need to know the ins and outs of how their data is structured to be able to build your own new platform, pieces of software or interesting research on top of the database that someone else has created. The implementation of the API in the classroom, it was um, a really a fantastic challenge not only for me, but mainly for my students, because working with the APIs, uh, it facilitates making a bridge between education and, and technology and give um, to my students uh, competences where they can see how to go to external repositories of, of data and implementing that in, in a perspective that they can have that direct connection. So it was um, really fantastic to have the uh, opportunity to work with the European um, APIs and to build something that was really useful and in a practical approach by demonstrating how it's possible to connect digital technology and education. The benefits of its implementation, it was that it allowed uh, my students to have contact with a real-world example in terms of uh, development. So they have the support from European staff in terms of understand how APIs work. We also have a partnership with the Monastery of Battaglia and the technicians, because they are experts on heritage, they also give them support on that particular. And the students were communicating with both sides to help them develop the project. At the same time, it allows us to, for them to develop their um, digital literacy skills. Also, they understand how they can customize the um, digital products by having access to an external repository by using um, APIs and how it makes possible for the preservation of the material, uh, in this case related with the Monastery of Battaglia, and how they were uh, able to produce something that they structure, but the content come from external uh, source.